we can have a uh, dog park, you know, where the dogs that get along with other dogs can run around and play and kind of, that kind of stuff. And the owners are responsible to make sure everything is kept clean. No, no, you don't. I don't trust you over there. No. Oh my gosh, she's strong. <laughs> this is. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> I'm drowning. <laughs> so Simon really, really is a good boy. He's just strong. Strong. <laughs> oh, Simon. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm going horsey. <laughs> so Simon is a boxer mix. He's a little bit hyper. Best thing is to give him walks and you might want to help train, get him under control on the, the lead. Oh, because I don't think he's had a lot of experience in that. But he looks just like a big old chunky boxer. So he is boxer mix, but he just looks like a big old tank here. So this is Simon. <laughs> this is Rover. Now I know the colors of him and uh, the tank were, are the same, but this Rover's tail is not dark. This is uh, oh, oh, you got it, didn't you? You got it. Yeah. Now Rover is an older guy. He's got the white on the face, and he is wonderful. The last time we put him on, he did the same thing. He's such a good. Take the leg. You got to do that before. Come here. Come here and say hello. Oh, oh. oh, he's just a lovey, dovey little man. Yeah, he's strong, as you can see the muscles in him. But he's such a good boy. He's not thrashing me and banging me into the into the um, the fence behind me. And I think he's happy. I think he's very happy right now. <laughs> yes. Oh, come on, get both. Take both. There we go. And magic, and there he is. And behold, the Almighty. <laughs> hey, Rover. Hey, hi. Can you sit right there? Can you get that big butt down? Can you sit it down? Oh, wouldn't he be wonderful? You're watching a, a scary movie on TV, and you get scared or you have a bad dream. Yeah, you need some snuggling. Everybody loves to snuggle in bed. Yes, they do. Now he's gone, and there he is. So, looks like he has a scar right there. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey, look at what I got. Hey, hey, Rover, Rover. He is very musical with his tail. Rover, can you sit? Sit. No? Okay. All right, this is Rover. Rover is a sweetheart of a dog. I would really love to see him go into a family. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Oh, you come here. Oh, don't, don't you dare. There. That bad boy. You mean bad boy. Yes. Oh, he's so sweet. I, you know, when you get the really, really great ones, not that they're all not great, but some are just, you know, a little more special. You hate to give them back. Yes. Yeah, so this is Rover. And he is a, I'm going to say a pit mix, Terry mix. And he is so sweet. And he's a happy man. And he's going to make somebody a great, great present. Now, the color bow I put on his head, I'm going to I'm gonna go with maybe a, a yellow or gold color to look good on him. So, this is Rover. This is Silsby. Silsby is a terrier mix. Very, very sweet dog. And uh, the special markings is his, the tips of his feet have gray on him. So he is a sweetheart. He's strong. He's a strong dog. And he's not even, oh, I was going to say you weren't even interested in that. Come on, get it. Oh, and he's not taking my fingers off. He's a good boy. Look how happy he is. Look at this tail going a mile a minute. Yes. Yeah, hey. Hi, Silsby. I don't know where they came up with Silsby. 
Guess my oh, sounds more like a girl's name. You got a girl's name. You got a girl's name. Silsby's got a girl's name. Yes. Not that it is girlish, in case somebody out there is named Silsby and is a boy. It is a wonderful name and a very handsome name. And so is our Silsby, as you are, I'm sure. Hey, go. Oh, he's just so, there's just so much to look at. There's so much. Hey, look at, look at. I don't want you. Oh. He is a strong guy. Yes, there. How about that? Oh, if I said it down, come on it. Come up here, Silsby. Up. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be much of a couch potato with it. No, oh my goodness gracious, again. The way to help him calm down is take him for a regular routine walk each day. If you, if you can, twice a day would be absolutely fantastic. You know, taking your dog for a walk is a great way to bond with the family and the dog and all that stuff. Um, the other thing is, when they're hyper like this and you really don't have time to sit and play, get one of those Kong-like ball things and put some peanut butter in there. I never was a fan of that, but I do that with my dog now. And it makes a great big difference when they're, you know, wanting you to play and they're grabbing you and stuff to occupy themselves. It's great. Or if you have company and the dog loves to visit with company too, give them something that's going to preoccupy them. Hey, hey, you know what? You know what? This is about you, honey. It's all about you. So... Just a reminder about uh, we're on YouTube. It's youtube.com. Pause, clause, four slash SPCA. I always get stuck on that. That's a hardy. It's hard to remember. And you're choking yourself. Come here. So Silsby is our last our last dog for t come here. Come here. Come here. Yes. Silsby is the last dog. I just want to remind you about Diamond. Uh, we could really use some help. Uh, help rehabilitate Diamond. Help her get around. She was moving around. Um, early when we were doing the show, I saw her moving around. I think it's probably more nerve damage than anything else. Her, she's not straightening out her back uh, knees, though, so somebody out there might know more than what I do and how to help her. But it's going to start with somebody out there helping us get her spirits up and realize there is more to life than just being sore and not moving around and all that good stuff. So... I hope you've seen something that you liked. If you didn't, come on down to the shelter. We have many more, so I'll catch you next week.